What is up guys, my name is Dante and thank you as always for watching another video. Today we have some more commander action for you. We have broke out the 2020 commanders and I'm playing one that you guys may have not seen yet. I'm playing Cthrill Aspect Warper, Warper, excuse me. Uh, when Cthrill Aspect Warper enters the battlefield, put a flying counter on any creature you control if a creature card in your graveyard has flying. Repeat this process for first strike, double strike, death touch, hex proof, indestructible, lifelink, menace, reach, trample, and vigilance. Then put a 1-1 one -one counter on Cthrill. For each counter, put on a creature this way. That was a mouthful. Uh, it's a 3-3 three, three for Asban and 2 Nightmare Insect. I'm playing Gabby the Nest Warden, uh, Jeskai. You may pay zero rather than, uh, rather than uh, its cycling cost for each card you cycle for the first time each turn. Whenever you draw your second card of a turn, create a 2-2 cat dinosaur. Sweet, all right. Well, I am have seven cards on the play, and Sean? I'm on seven. On Actually, play. we don't know who's on the play, do we? No. We will roll for that really quickly. You guys can watch seven. And I am gonna be on the play because Sean rolled a six without wasting any more time. Let's get right into it. I'm gonna play a Sansep Citadel and pass the turn. Play a Command Tower, pass the turn. All right, untap and draw. I'm gonna play a Jungle Hollow, gain a life, I believe, and pass the turn. Okay. Play Island, tap two, Ominous Seas. Whenever you draw a card, put a four shadow counter on Ominous Seas. Remove eight counters. Uh, four shadow counters from Ominous Seas create an 8-8 eight, eight Kraken. Sweet. Hester. And how do you get counters on that again? I'm sorry. Just drawing a card. By simply drawing a card. Excellent. Um, all right, I'm gonna play Exotic Orchard, which is great with the Command Tower. I'm gonna tap for two white and a color. And play Aerial Responder. Yep. Uh, two, three, five, Flying Vigilance Lifelink and pass the turn. Untap. Draw counter on the Omnis Seas. Sure. That it do do. Play a Plains. Tap two. Hoof Prince of the Stag. Wow. Whenever you draw a card, you may put a Hoof Print counter on Hoof Prince of the Stag. Mm -hmm. Pay one white and two colors. Remove four Hoof Print counters from, the from uh, Hoof Prince of the Stag and create a 4-4 four, four white elemental creature token with flying. Activate this only during your turn. Excellent. Faster. Untap. Draw. Move to combat. Swing for two. I'm going to take two. I'm going to gain two. Oops, wrong way. Let's see here. Let's play Caves of Quillos. Yep. And pass. One tap. Draw. I'll put a counter on the Ominous Seas and a counter on the Hoofprints. So you don't have to sacrifice the enchantment once you get eight counters. You just remove eight counters. That's correct. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty good. That is pretty good. Let's tap three and play Abandoned Sarcophagus. You may cast spells with cycling, uh, cycling, cycling ability from your graveyard. If you, if a card that has cycling would go to your, your graveyard, exile from anywhere. If it wasn't cycled, exile instead. Okay, excellent. That's true. All right, draw. All right. Let's play a swamp. Yep. Move to combat. Yep. Thing for two. Yep. I'm gonna go to 36. I'm gonna go to 45. Um. I'm gonna pass the turn. All right. Draw. Put a counter and put a counter. Okay. I'm gonna play an island. I'm gonna tap five, uh, that for red. I'm gonna play a Kim, the Soaring Sky. Uh, it's a flying creature with three, f uh, flying three, four creature. Uh, whenever you create one or more tokens for the first time each turn, create a one, one white bird token with flying. And then I can pay six, one of one of each chess guy color and three colors. Mm -hmm. uh, creatures, you, t creature tokens you control game double strike until the turn. Okay. 
and I'm going to pass the turn. All right, at the end of your turn, I'm going to tap a green and a black to play Grizzly Savage. Salvage, sorry. Revealing the top five cards in my library. Yep. You would put a creature or a land from among them into your hand, the yep. rest into the graveyard. One, two, three, four, and five. Let's see. <clears throat> Let's put the township in our hand. All right, Gavin Township. Seems yep. good. And the rest in there, and move to my turn. Mm -hmm. Untap, draw. Move to combat. Yep. Swing for two. Block. Okay. Cast the commander. King your two first. Yep. Seven. Okay, so you have Flying Vigilance Lifelink. And Vigilance. <laughs> flying Vigilance Lifelink. Okay, let's see. So it gets three counters. Yep. Do you have a Lifelink counter over there? I'm sure you do. Here it is. Flying, Vigilance, Lifelink, 6-6. Six, six. Play the Township. Yep. Pass the turn. Oh, first Untap, draw. draw. Counter, counter. Gabby. Okay. Free cycle for the turn. It's going to be draw a card, trigger, trigger, trigger. Okay. Uh, hmm. And actually trigger. Perfect. Yes. Yes, it does. I got the tokens. Pastor. All right, untap, draw. Let's play nesting grounds. Yep. Play acidic slime. Sure, target. Um, let's target. I think let's see. This one seems like it can be difficult. Let's go with the ominous seed. Okay. Um, it's exiled because it wasn't cycled. One, two, three. Uh, combat? Yep. Swing for three, uh, sorry, six in the air. Block. All right, uh, gain six. Yep. Pass the turn. Draw, counter. Oh, so if it doesn't have cycling, it gets exiled. Is that how that works? I'm if sorry. If a card was cycling. If a card was cycling, got it. Tap three, play shiny impotence. Yeah. On my dinosaur cat. You get a treasure every time it attacks? Correct. Okay. Uh, move to combat. Yep. Get a treasure? Yep. Uh, 
Get a treasure, create a bird. Okay. Uh, swing in for four. Swing in for four with three mana. Yep. <clears throat> uh, let's block with acidic slime. Sure. Yep. Damage. Um, cards in hand. Four. Pressure. All right. Untap. Draw. Ever after? Return up to two target creature cards from your graveyard to the battlefield. Each of those creatures is a black zombie in addition to its other colors and types. Put Ever After on the bottom of its owner's library. Okay, targets. I'm targeting Acidic Slime and Callum's Captain. Okay. It's a 5-5 five, five Vigilance with a uh, pay 7 for Monstrosity 3. And then when it becomes monstrous, exile all artifacts and enchantments. All right. Uh, when they enter the battlefield, uh, Acidic Slime will target um, Sorry, I have to read this one more time. I'm still confused. They cast spells that have a cycling ability from your graveyard. If a card that has a cycling ability would be put into the graveyard from anywhere and it wasn't cycled, exile it instead. So you cycle for free, it gets in there. That's just a lot of cards. Or do I care about the four fours? I think we're going to exile this guy. Destroy it, you mean? Uh, destroy it, sorry, yes. Okay. I'm thinking about. Um, okay, and then move to combat. Sure. Swing with the uh, warper. Bird seems like a good blocker there. Yep, yeah, uh, I will gain six and pass the turn. Draw. Remove four stag prints. Create a four four elemental and a bird. Four four elemental and a bird. And those have double strike? Only if I pay six. Only if you pay six. Got it. Six. Um, pass turn. All right. Untap. Drop. Battlefield. Okay. Oh, that is extremely unfortunate. All right. Combat? Sure. Swing with the Aspect Warper? Double block. Bird, okay. Triple block. Triple block. Okay. Um, it'll hit. How much do I have? Six, four, five. It'll hit like uh, like this. Okay. Uh, I'll gain six. Yep. And we'll put Cathril. In the command zone. Okay. Play the wander? Sure. Hmm. 
play Canopy Vista. Okay. And pass. I think it has Flying Vigilance Life Link. That's it. For now, I guess we can put these on there. Just they don't have counters, but just so the camera can see and remember. All right. Fluctuator. Fluctuator. Cycling abilities you activate cost up to two less to activate. Yep. Can it reduce them to zero? It cannot. Or it can. Yeah, it can. <laughs> <That> was... <laughs> pass. All right, pass. Untap. But it can't reduce color. Draw. Okay. Let's it says vigilance and so does this. Let's swing like this. Cool. Block there, so that is six power? Mm. Yep. Okay, well, before damage, let's seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, let's make it monstrous. Okay. And we'll hit uh, Gabby first. Okay. And... Four, five, six. Yep, gain four. And pass the turn. Could really use a land right now. I know, I feel so bad for you. You don't. I do, I really. <laughs> These commanders are very exciting, but of course you've got to have the. That's true. And you're at 30? Yeah, I'm 30. All right, untap, draw. He says, you don't. Uh, combat. Yep. Like this. Everything. Okay. All right, damage. Um, hmm. Cards in? Uh, I've got five, uh, five cards in hand. Very good. Okay, so move to damage. You take eight, I gain four. Yep. This dies. What is that? And this dies. Yeah. Right. <clears throat> I will play Zatalfa. Zatalfa? Seems awesome. Uh, and I will pass. Okay. Will I draw land? Cycle, draw card, doesn't seem to matter. Best turn. All right, untap, draw. <clears throat> so this cost me one, two, three, four, seven. Five. Total. Seven. All right, let's move to combat. Sure. Swing. Uh, I'll take 
16. Yep. I'm going to go to 6. All right. And play the commander. Sure. It's a lot of counters. Is it? Death Touch, Flying Vigilance, Life Link. Three? Three counters? Four counters. Four counters, yeah. Um, Life Link, Vigilance, Flying, Death Touch, and four counters. And yep. then play a Soul Ring and Pass. Sure. Tap draw. Tap six. All right. Set upon the sinful. Oh, what does that do? Exile all creatures, delirium, very, very which good. I do have. I have four different card types. So nice. I create a four four angel. Wow, very good. Okay, so exile these guys. Oh, exile, are you sure you can't just destroy them? Or try to? <laughs> I'm glad it doesn't destroy. Yep. Because Ltalpa would still be there. That's right. Faster. All right, wow. Uh, untap. Draw, did you pull that off the top by chance? No, I was trying to get Amanda to play that card for okay. a while. Okay. Now I'm finding myself searching. I think I can do this again, right? Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Uh, that costs four more. Costs nine total. Putting it at nine, so let's try it again. Yep. Same thing, because um, those got exiled, unfortunately. Vigilance, Death Touch, Flying, Life Link, and Four Counters. Yep. Pass to you. Six, play the Locust God. Oh, wow, okay. Last turn. Uh-huh, all right. Untap, draw. Predatory Impetus. Okay. One, two. Sorry. Ooh. Five. Okay. One, two, three, four. Five. Yep. Can I throw? Sure. You got eight. Sure, I had that right. Anything have death touch? Nope. All right, swing for eight. Walk the looks go. Uh huh. I'll return to my hand at the beginning of the next next step. All right, gain seven. Oh, sorry, ten life. Yep. All right, let's go. Uh... Might be easier if you just use that. Yeah. So what do we have after that ten? I think I was at three. So um, twenty-four, thirty-three, forty-three more. There's 60. Yeah. 43 total. Here, this one might be a little bit better. There you go. You see it a little bit better. That's, yeah. That is the new Ikori of Fat Pack Die, also. All right, let's go with. Rebel Arc? Sure. And go ahead. Comes back to my hand. Draw. Getting down to these nitty gritty points of the game is always fun. If you've enjoyed it so far, please leave a like and let us know if you want to see any of these matchups. We're going to try to get as much as we can up 
for you. I think right now we're playing Kithril and Gavi. Uh, we need Kalamax to come back. So depending on who wins this, we will be playing Kalamax next. So make sure you are subscribed and hit those notifications so you don't miss any of the exciting content. Sun Titan. Oh, man. Uh, yep. Let's get... Shiny Impotence back on my Sun Titan. Yeah. Press turn. All right, untap. Draw. Grim Backwoods? Yep. The Johnny's unyielding? Yep. <clears throat> Let's exile the Sun Titan. You gain eight life. Okay. Go to two. want to just win there what didn't want to just win there did i miss a win exile my angel i don't have any flyers oh sun titan looks like he has wings i thought he could fly he doesn't have any any he can't fly kind of wings cool well that's what happens uh let's go with um combat sure swing uh, block all right go to 10 okay gain 10 And let's play this. Go ahead. It's the daring friend bonder. Didn't want to just play that. It has haste. <laughs> All right. Thank you guys. All right, guys. <laughs> Getting to the end pause of the game. I'm, I might have overlooked a few cards abilities, but that's all right. A win's a win, I guess. If you enjoyed the video, please leave a like. Like I said, we're bringing Calamax back. So, uh, yeah, it'll be a great video. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss that. And we'll see you next time.